Hey, good morning, y'all. Dan from Deeds Out, Texas here. Coming at you from the truck. Just letting the truck warm up a little bit before I take off. It's still kind of dark outside right now. I have a the light from my phone on. Hopefully the lighting's okay. Just uh, smoking some uh, Cornell and Deal Star of the East. Normally, I would be smoking uh, some early morning. But uh, I'm going to have to start slowing my roll on that one a little bit. Don't have very much of it left. Um, I did get a 10 from a buddy of mine. He had cracked it open a while back, and it kind of dried out. So I did uh, rehydrate it, and it, uh, it took. So we're good there for a little while, at least. I'm pretty sure I can find some somewhere, maybe. Hopefully. We'll see what happens. Yeah, I just want to do a quick video. I've actually been trying to, I've been trying to do a video for a while. Uh, it just seems that, you know, life has been happening and, well, being with the holidays and family's been around, and it's been kind of hard to sit down and notch out a chunk of time just to kind of do a little, little video. But I, I ordered, uh, ordered some uh, tobacco. Some different, some different tins. Some of the stuff I, I have uh, in my rotation is kind of running a little low, so I reordered. And some things I uh, just wanted to try new. Well, new for me. Yo. So. Without further ado, let's check this out. I ordered this through uh, Pipes and Cigars. They were having a uh, sale on the, some of the Dunhill blends, some of the ones they still had in stock. Now I was debating whether I should even order that, to be honest, because if you can't get a hold of it anymore after a while, I don't know. I, I, and if you don't have a seller of it, I debated whether I should even buy any of it. Just for simple fact that I wouldn't be able to reorder it, so. Pipe cleaners. Oddly enough, the ones I normally get, they didn't have in stock, so I had to get a different brand. I'm gonna try these out for the first time. Uh, which I thought was kinda odd for them not carrying pipe cleaners. We're not having them in stock. There's some uh, tins right there. Now, I've never had it before, but I thought I'd try it out. I did order uh, three tins of uh, Dirt Bar from Dunhill. I've heard some good things about it. Uh, I didn't want to try it, so we'll see how it goes. Get all these tins out.
Here's the three tins of Durbar. Orlick Dark Strong, Kentucky. I have a couple tins of this left, but uh, normally I like to keep about two or three in stock. I had under one, so I, I just opened one, so I wanted to make sure I had another one for backup. This is another one, uh, Russell S. Firestorm right here. It's another blend I like a lot. Um, again, I was running a little low on that, got two tins of that one. And then uh, Orlick uh, Golden Slice, another one uh, that I keep in stock most of the time. Just running a little low on that one, so I wanted to replenish that. Couple other tips. Now, I have a couple of the uh, HH lines, and I like them. So I wanted to try a couple of other ones. Um, this is the one I I have. Uh, right low. I only have a little bit of this one left, so reordered that one. Um, ones I wanted to try was this one, the Burley Flake. Starting to get into Burleys. Uh, I wanted to try this one since I like the other HH. I thought that maybe uh, I'd give this one a shot. Haven't seen any reviews. Haven't looked at this one really at all. Uh, just decided to buy it. And then I got the, um, the Bold Kentucky from HH as well. Uh, I like I like the Orlix. Uh, you know, I like that those type of blends. So I think that I'll enjoy that one as well. I'm going to be placing another order pretty soon um, for my Christmas present. <laughs> it's coming a little later this year. But uh, on that one, I was going to try some bulk, uh, some bulk blends and some other, other tobaccos that I haven't tried at all. And uh, when I get those in, I'll show those to you as well. I want to try things outside my comfort zone. And uh, kind of, I don't know, just try new things to see what I like. I know I like Virginias. I know I like Kentuckys. I like Kias. Trying Burleys out. I um, think the other ones are going to be mostly Burley based. We'll, we'll see what happens. But yeah, the new year, man, around the corner. Around the corner. I don't know about you guys, but this year for me, it has been fast. I mean, just fast. Can't believe it's almost over. There's been a lot going on for me this year. A lot going on for me. My little girl, she, uh, my oldest, she turned four. So this year, she, this was the first year she started in school. So that was a change for me. Having my little baby girl, Emma, from the beginning of the year. Uh, just uh, things with work have been progressing, getting a lot busier there. Uh, we started building another house. I see some videos going up about that as well. A lot to be thankful for this year. A lot to be thankful for. Well, guys, uh, I'm going to go ahead and start off to work. Uh, still a little early here, but I got a couple errands I got to run before that. I want to say uh, just thank you to you guys out there, YTPC. I enjoy uh, everybody out there, everybody that's putting content up and all the videos. Uh, uh, it's kind of a routine now. I, I after my morning devotion, I watch uh, watch the videos with a cup of coffee, and uh, yeah, that's how I start my day now. <laughs> All right, guys, you have a good one. This is Dan, Deep South Texas, signing off. Catch you later.